टुडे वी हैव डिस्कस अबाउट द प्रैक्टिकल फोर विच इज द सिंथेसिस ऑफ सल्फानिलामाइड इट इज़ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट एंटी बैक्टीरियल एज वेल एज एंटी फंगल ड्रग इन सल्फानिलामाइड वी हैव टू सीन हियर दर इज टू बेसिक ग्रुप इज अवेलेबल एन एच टू ग्रुप एंड अनदर इज एसओ टू एन एच टू ग्रुप सो नाउ वी कैन स्टार्ट विद सम बेसिक इन्फॉर्मेशन एंड बैकग्राउंड ऑफ दैट सल्फानिलामाइड बेसिकली इट 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 इज अनिलीन डेरीवेटिव ऑफ सल्फोनामाइड ग्रुप विच ट्रीटेड एज ए एंटी बैक्टीरियल ड्रग एंड इन अ वर्ल्ड वॉर सोल्जर वॉर पाउडर सल्फानिलामाइड यूज फॉर द रिड्यूस द इन्फेक्शन रे इट्स कंट्रीब्यूट ड्रामेटिक रिडक्शन इन मॉर्टेलिटी रेट्स इट्स यूज एज एंटी बैक्टीरियल इन अ ड्रग वाउंड एंड इट्स ऑल्सो यूज इन अ वेजनल ईस्ट इन्फेक्शन सो इट्स ऑल्सो कॉल्ड अ एंटी फंगल एजेंट द साइड इफेक्ट ऑफ दैट ड्रग इफ यू टेकन सच अ मोर अमाउंट दैन इट एलर्जिक रिएक्शन like a rash hives itching red skin swelling blisters peeling skin or without favor it's wheezing and all another the side effect is liver problem blood problem very bad skin reactions like stevenson johnson syndrome or toxic epidermal necrolysis that is basically the side effect of that sulfanilamide if you take on such a more amount then the principle on which the drug is working that is the sulfanilamide can be prepared by taking acetonilide group and treating with the excess of chlorosulfonic acid gives para acetamido benzene sulfonyl chloride which readily convert into the corresponding para amino benzene sulfonamide upon the reaction of ammonia or ammonium carbonate this acetamido group can be easily undergoes acid catalyzed hydrolysis reactions and form para amino benzene sulfonilamide it is called sulfanilamide what is the aim of that practical the aim is to prepare sulfanilamide from acetanilide now the requirement is chlorosulfonic acid we need chlorosulfonic acid concentrated ammonia dilute sulfuric acid sodium bicarbonate and concentrated hydrochloric acid now here that there is a mole ratio calculation for that one and now we are switch to the mole ratio calculation and now we are switch to the mole ratio calculation of taken amount so here we take a 10 g so that is a that considered as a q that is r that is a that is a b that is a c d e and f so our primary goal is to get r so now start with a b b is equal to q by a which is 10 divided by 135.17 and here we get 0.0739 in addition to that if we want to get a e then we must multiply d into b so that is 5.20 which is d and e b is equal to 0.0739 so we get the e and the e value is 0.384 so here we get 0.384 and upside we get 0.0739 so on the basis of that we conclude for the r so r is equal to e into f So E we get 0.0384 and F is equal to 116.53 with the molecular weight of chlorosulfonic acid and here we get 44.82 gram. So if we want to chlorosulfonic acid in ml, so we must divide with the density of it and then finally we get 25.57 ml of chlorosulfonic acid. That is what we want to take for that practical. so the next slide gives a reaction of that chlorosulfonic acid concentrated ammonia concentrated hcl with n phenyl acetonilin or acetonilide so that is when you when we use three reagents together and the finally we get this kind of product the molecular weight here also mentioned and here also it is mentioned so now uh, we can take a deep look about the mechanism how mechanism proceed and how mechanism is work this lone pair here is attack over here attack over here or that position and then this group is slightly removed for that purpose and then we get our this so2cl at the bottom side so again we attack through that nh2 group so the lone pair of nh2 is directly attack to the chlorine group and finally we get that so2 nh2 group when we add this concentrated hcl into that then the mixtures then we get that hydrochloride salt here and after the basic treatment we will get our compound back so here we get nh2 that is reaction mechanism for that preparation of sulfanilamide 
In the next we will see the procedure. In the procedure first divide into three step. The first step is to prepare acetomido group to prepare para acetomido benzene sulfonyl chloride group. How it's prepared? So first to get 20 gram of the dry acetylide in a flask and chlorosulfonic acid 50 ml the dropping funnels attached to a calcium guard tube into the later. So add chlorosulfonic acid in a small portion and shake the flask very vigorously. Heat the reaction mixture on the water bath for one hour after the mixing order to complete the reaction. Keep sometimes cooling then pour the oily mixture in thin stream with 300 grams ice contain one liter of beaker. Carry out this operation carefully in the fume cupboard. So excess of chlorosulfonic acid react vigorously with the water. So rinse the flask little ice water and add constant after rinsing the co content of a beaker. Break up the lumps of the solid material and mix contained by stirring several minutes. Obtain the even suspension of a granules white solid. Filter the para acetomido benzene sulfonyl chloride at a pump, wash it with the cold water and crude product immediately take it to the next step. So here second step, the crude product what we get here rinse in a reaction flask, add 70 ml of concentrated ammonia solution and 70 ml of water, mix the both content in a flask, heat the reaction mixture occasionally swearing in fuming cup board and just below the boiling point 50 minutes of sulfonyl chloride it will be converted into a paste T suspension corresponding sulfonamide. Cool the product suspension in ice then add dilute sulfuric acid until its acid color congo red appear. Collect the product on a Buckner funnel wash the little with cold water and para acetamido sulfonamide at 100 degree temperature. Its 80 gram product we will receive the material is sufficient for the next step. So the next step we will take the para acetamido benzene sulfonamide to a 500 ml beaker add 10 ml sulfuric acid and 30 ml of water boil the mixture gently reflux for 30 to 45 minutes cool down the solution to the room temperature should deposit in no solid amide if the solid separate heat the further for a short period treat the cooled solution for 2 gram decolorized carbon to remove that colored impurity heat a mixture up to boil and filter with the suction through a harder filter paper. Place filter paper of a mixture, a solution of sulfonylamide hydrochloride in a 1 liter of beaker. Carefully add 16 gram of hydrogen carbonate in a some position with constant stirring. After evolution of gas has been subsidized, test the suspension with litmus paper and if it is still acid, add more sodium hydrogen carbonate and then neutralize it, cool it using ice, filter of the uh, sulfonylamide with suction and dry it. 15 gram yield we will get this means 59 percent yield we get. The melting point is 161 to 163 of, of a normal product and the recrystallization has been occurred using the water and alcohol mixtures and the recrystallized product melting point is 163 to 164 degrees centigrade. So now we switch the calculation. Calculation mein jo hum starting material jo lege, wo light hoga. So calculation ke andar, hum jo starting reagent lege, wo light hoga. And this molecular weight itna hai. Uh, molecular formula ye hai. Iski molecular sulfonylamide ki formula, molecular formula ye hai. Molecular weight 135.17 gram per mole hai. Sulfonylamide ka 172.20 gram per mole hai. Hum calculation karenge. Hume theoretical yield yahan pe milega. Aur practical yahan pe mention hai ke 6.8 leke aapko kaam karna hai. On the basis of practical yield, you will have to find the percentage yield. Okay. So next we switch to the characterization table. In characterization, suppose here we get this two peak like one is three four double zero centimeter inverse and here there is 1700 centimeter inverse 1200 centimeter inverse. So we have to choose this two peak we want to get calculate for the two peak centimeter and we will put it that down okay here we have frequency kya aegi ns2 or so2 ns2 koi wo hume likhni hoogi ab characterization mein hum kisi na kisi ko to m plus peak lenge thik hai here m plus one peak bhi aega m plus two peak bhi aega इसका जो हमने मॉलिक्यूलर वेट पहले देखा था वो 172 था ठीक है सो यहां पे 172 का तो m प्लस पीक आ ही रहा है दूसरा m प्लस 1 पीक 173 पे आ रहा है और तीसरा m प्लस 2 पीक 174 पे आ रहा है सो so हियर हमें तीन पीक मिलेंगे m प्लस m प्लस 1 m प्लस 2 अब हम इसके बाद देखेंगे nmr अब nmr के अंदर बहुत ही सिंपल सा लॉजिक है ये वाला जो nh2 है 
वो बहुत नज़दीक आएगा बिकॉज इज डायरेक्टली अटैच विद द रिंग अब दूसरे वाला जो एन है ना वो जरा और डाउन फील्ड जाएगा बिकॉज उसकी जो ये ये वाला जो एन है ये वाला एन एस टू सिक्स पॉइंट जीरो सिक्स पर है जो ये प्राइमरी है जो एरोमेटिक एन एस टू सीधा है वही ये है अब जो सिक्स पॉइंट एटी नाइन की मैं बात कर रहा हूँ वो ये वाला है सो ये वाला जो एन एस टू है वो एसओ टू के साथ अटैच जो एन एस टू होगा उसकी ये पीक होगी ये जो दो पीक सिंगलेट सिंगलेट आपको दिख रही है वो पीक होगी सिक्स पॉइंट फिफ्टी एट पर इन दो हाइड्रोजन्स की जो यहाँ पर हाइड्रोजन होते हैं उसकी और बाकी जो बहुत ही ज़्यादा अप आएंगी वो दो हाइड्रोजन बिकॉज ऑफ दैट सल्फोनाइल ग्रुप विच इज इलेक्ट्रॉन विड्रॉइंग इट सेल्फ सो यहाँ से इलेक्ट्रॉन जाएगा और ये शिफ्ट होगा टूवर्ड्स दैट सो ये बहुत ही हमें ऊपर की साइड मिलेगा कंपेयर टू अदर प्रोटॉन शिफ्ट यहाँ पर रिजल्ट टेबल दिखा है इसके बाद आपको डिटेल ये फील करनी होगी कन्फ्यूजन के अंदर हम ये लिखेंगे द आई आर मास एंड एर एम आर कैक्टराइजेशन टेक्निक कन्फर्म दैट द प्रेजेंस ऑफ सो एंड सो ग्रुप विच इज आइडेंटिफाई फॉर द प्रिपरेशन ऑफ सल्फान दिल्ला माइड एंड परसेंटेज यील्ड वॉज फाउंड टू बी दैट अमाउंट सो परसेंटेज आपको यहाँ पे जो मिलेगी वो आपको लिखनी है और ग्रुप जो यहाँ पे एन एच टू और एसओ टू एन एच टू जो है उसका हमने कंफर्मेशन थ्रू आई आर मास और उससे किया है वो हमें लिखना होगा यह कुछ रेफरेंसेस आज के लिए बस इतना ही थैंक यू फॉर वाचिंग।